Hi everyone, uh, this is Bill. In this video, I'm going to introduce how you can uh, install the ACT MVR 3.0 and uh, where you can get it. So first, of course, you can uh, go to our website, www.acti.com. After that, there's a link here, Video Management System. Just simply just click. After that, you can find there's a link here, ACT MVR 3.0. So in this page, you can see the detail spec, and also you can download the data sheet as well, for sure. And uh, the most updated uh, version is here. Of course, you have uh, different tabs you can click and you can view. Okay, about the MVR 3.0. Okay, so I'm just simply just click, and it takes a while. So I already download it here. So you can simply just uh, unzip. Okay, so now you got the, the folder here. Actually, there are two parts. The one is server, the one is workstation. Why we have two parts? Let me explain here. The server is just like a car. Actually, it did um, everything, uh, the backend, like uh, the recording, all the things. Uh, it's uh, like when you drive a car. Actually, it's a car is driving, right? The car brings you to the place you want to go. But you still need a wheel to control the car. And workstation is a wheel. So you can image that you can install the server and workstation in the same computer, or you can install the server in the computer uh, you are currently using, or the computer you want to do to, be, uh, to make it to be the server. And you can install the workstation in another computer, or you can use, use the Internet Explorer to log into the server as well. So it's two options for the wheel the workstation and uh, the Internet Explorer. And the server is the car you drive, is the server, is the recording, is all the things uh, with the, the MVR. So you just simply click the server, install. It's a very simple, just next, 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 next. And it's just finished. But I need to restart the computer, so I'll just skip this part. But just uh, uh, like uh, always click next. The same here, the workstation. This one, <clears throat> the same, and just simply click next, 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 next. There's no actually any options you have to know, or only a very small uh, things. But uh, basically, you can just next, 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 and simply very quick, just finish. When you finish the installation, and you will see either way, <clears throat> like uh, you can see this icon on your browser. On your sorry, on your program files, or you can use the IE. Then let's try. You can double click the workstation, and you can see this page, and just simply just log in. When you first time, a login the 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 page will be different, but uh, still next next next, and you can see this page. And let's try uh, the Internet Explorer because I install uh, in the same computer, so I just uh, click uh, localhost. It's the same, so I can simply just uh, log in. The default account name is admin. The password is one two three four five six, and still the same. You can log in, and the interface will be exactly the same, just like what you saw in the workstation. So it's the same. And uh, <clears throat> before uh, the end of this video, I'm just uh, introduce the basic interface here. There's a three tabs here. It's very simple. The first one is the live view, which will be in this tab. The second one is the playback. And the third one is uh, they got all the things you want to uh, like uh, set the uh, MVR different settings and how you how you can you add the camera schedule and different kind of functions is all in these tabs. So the base basically I will <coughs> uh, introduce more features in the following videos. And uh, but this video is just showing you how to install and where you can get the Acti MVR 3.0. Thank you. And this is Bill from Acti.